What's up, you guys? My name is Mary. I'm with High Priestess Intuition. Welcome, my current subscribers, and welcome, 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 newbies. If you guys are new to my channel, Cancer, and you enjoy my content, you can uh, smash the sub button to be notified for future readings. Just saying. This is How Do They Feel About You for the Sonic Cancer. This covers an APF Cancer in any aspects of your chart Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, or Sun, Moon, or Jupiter. Don't forget the basics. Time is fluid. Energy is fluid. If it doesn't apply, let it fly. Everyone has free will. Only take the messages that resonate with you. This can resonate if you have any aspects of cancer in your chart. Free general reading, so it's very important to only take the messages that resonate with you and leave the rest. Thanks, everybody, for all the love, support, and love and support to the channel. I appreciate all the likes, subscribes, shares, and donations. If you'd like to donate, it's High Priestess 405. The link's in the description box below. I am so open for personal readings. It's $100 for, for 50 minutes. If you are interested, uh, you have to text me. My number's in the description box below. This whole twin flame stuff sometimes scares me reversed. I can tell tell you, uh, don't trust me. I want to change that. I have inner childhood wounds. I've thought about spending time uh, with my family. I thought about you spending time with my family and me. Paradise reversed. Camera reversed. Twin flames upright. Oh my God. You've got twin flame times two cancer. Holy crap. Twin flame connection. This whole twin flame stuff sometimes scares me reverse. You you have twin flames times two. So I think you either know, um, I think this person knows they're your twin flame. Or you know they're your twin flame. However, that resonates, energies can be reversed, but this is how do they feel about you. So I think they know they're your twin flame. Or they think you're their you, you are their twin flame. However, that resonates. Because we have this whole twin flame stuff sometimes scares me. So the twin flame connection does not scare this person. And you have the twin flame card. Balance, union, duality, coupling. So the twin flame journey does not scare them. I can tell, tell you don't trust me. I want to change that. For some, they're about to really put in the effort. Okay, I heard for some, they're about to really put in the effort. So for some of you guys, um, they 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 feel they're they are about to put in the effort. They feel that you're worth it. That they know you're uh, you you are their twin flame, and they are about to put in the effort to let you know that is what I'm feeling. I have inner childhood wounds. You know, this person has been severely abused in the past. This person has really healed themselves, but still has healing to do. Okay, so you plug it in how it resonates. If this resonates with you, I heard you know you know this person was abused in the past. So I think they were abused as a child for some of them. Uh, for some, it could have been as a young adult, some as a middle-aged adult, but they were abused in the past in some shape, form, or fashion. Um, childhood wounds or, you know, adult wounds or what have you, but some kind of past wound energy. But you know, you know they were, um, if this resonates, you know they were in some shape, form, or fashion. I heard they have done some healing work, but they still have some healing work they need to do. So there's still some trauma there uh, from whatever abuse they occurred, occurred for them, however that resonates. It could have been mental, physical, financial, spiritual, or um, sexual, however that resonates, one or all. I thought about you. I thought about you spending time with my family and me. This person is definitely a family person, and you know this. Very family oriented. Okay, I heard you know this person is definitely a family person. Very family oriented. So this person, um, I think they love children or they have children or they want children, however that resonates, but they're very family oriented. So they either have children or they have plans on wanting children um, with you, however that resonates, um, however that resonates, but they're very family oriented. Um, that's good. Paradise reversed, happiness, expansion, joy, playfulness, oneness, enjoying each other. Energetically separated. 
However, you have made this happen. Okay, I heard energetically separated. However, you have made this happen. So if this resonates with you, you're energetically separated from your twin flame, but you have made this happen in some shape, form, or fashion. So paradise reverse. So you have destroyed paradise. I'm not destroyed paradise, but you have cut out happiness for you and your twin. <laughs> if this resonates for you, maybe just for one of you guys, but I heard at least for one cancer in the universe, you've made this happen. So you're energetically separated from this person. If this message, specific message resonates with you, maybe for some you're not. But you have happiness reversed. Maybe for some you're unhappy in the twin flame connection right now and you're energetically connected. Maybe for some you are with your twin. Uh, maybe for some you're not. And I feel the ones that are not, you have energetically separated yourself um, free willingly. So you plug it in how it resonates. The ones that are together, maybe you're just going through a rough patch. And, it's, and that's why it's happiness reversed. Camera reversed. Reminiscing, keepsake, perception. Making memories. This person has memories of you from the past and you have memories of them from the past, but it's been a really long time. And for some, not many memories spent together recently. Okay, so you plug in and how it resonates. So for some of you guys, um, you are energetically connected. You're with your twin right now. If this resonates, I uh, heard not many memories made recently. And I heard a spirit message in here earlier that they want to work on it. So, um, and that could go for the ones that are energetically separated or energetically together right now. How that resonates. But, um, but for some, you're with this person. You are with your twin right now, but you're going through a rough patch, it sounds like. But I heard they, um, they want to work on it. But you're not making many memories together right now to work on it, basically. For the ones that are you, for the one specific cancer that has specifically cut themselves out of their twin's life, it sounds like for strategic reasons, obviously you're not making any memories with this person, obviously, because you're not with them. Because <laughs> um, you free willingly did it, if this resonates. But um, I think you, I think it's a person in your past, is what I'm saying, for that person. I think it's a person in your past. Um, absolutely freaking uh, for some. You plug it in how it resonates. And then twin flames. Double twin flame cards in here. Um, that hardly ever freaking happens. Double confirmation, just saying. And your twin, if this resonates with you, whether you're energetically connected with them right now or you're separated and you free willingly separated yourself from them, they, they are not scared of the twin flame stuff. They know how it works. They know how the twin flame journey goes. They, I mean, they're not ignorant to the twin flame journey, basically. It does not scare them. They are knowledgeable about it. Yin, yin yang, zen, balance, union, duality, coupling, complement each other. Definitely complement each other. They know this and you know this. But they are used to being very independent. Okay. I heard um, that y'all definitely complement each other. So if this resonates with you, you and your twin, whether you're together right now or energetically separated, you definitely complement each other. But they're, they're used to being very independent. So I think before they met you, for the ones that are together right now, they were used to being very independent. So maybe that's why y'all are not making many, many memories together right now, because they're so used to being independent. Um, and I get that because I've been independent by myself, relationship-wise, for a really, really, really long time. A really long time. So if I ever got into a relationship, it would be hard for me to constantly be around the person because I'm not used to that, um, if that helps somebody out there. And that's just the truth. That's the truth. Um, it's hard for the really independent ones that are used to doing it on their own all the time to to go to being codependent on somebody because they're not used to that um if that helps somebody um but at least one of you guys is twin flames very independent so if you truly care and you know that they're your twin i would just give it some time and some communication if that helps somebody for the ones that are currently energetically connected and communicating or live in the same home or etc cetera, etc cetera, 
um, because um, it's not that they don't care, I feel, for some of these um, twins cancer, um, especially the ones that currently are in energetic contact and currently you live with or, or dating or what have you. Um, it's just that they're used to being so independent. They're used to just taking care of themselves or themselves and their kids. So they're not used to having a partner. Um, and I can attest to that because I have not had a partner in a really, really, really long time. So I can, I understand that is what I'm saying. Um, so hopefully that helps somebody out there. Now for the one that has free willingly cut themselves out of their twin's life, um, you know, that's a different story. <laughs> You plug that in, how that resonates. I mean, if you've cut, free willingly cut your twin out of your life, thank God they're independent because, or they're with somebody else, however that resonates. Leo energy, Scorpio energy, Pisces energy, Leo, Scorpio, Pisces energy is what I heard. Leo, Scorpio, and Piscean. So your twin could be a Leo, a Scorpio, or a Piscean. You plug it in, however that resonates, if that resonates for you, Cancer. Um, Leo, Scorpio, Scorpio. Um, Leo, Scorpio, and Piscean energy. They could have Leo, Scorpio, or Piscean energy in their sun, moon, rising, Venus, North, and Midnight with Jupiter. It could be one person with all those in their chart or three separate people. You plug in how it resonates, but usually you only have one twin flame in a lifetime. Um, so I feel it's at least for three of you guys out there. Leo, Scorpio, and Piscean. You plug it in how it resonates. I hope this helped. Love you guys. Namaste.